What's up guys and welcome to Nutero. I am the energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the love spread for somebody. So let's see the name of this reading. Cancer. What's up Cancer? Thank you so much for being here. This message could resonate with you if you have Cancer as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. All right, Cancer, so I'm going to do this love um, reading a little differently. I'm going to use a love spread this time. So let's, I'm going to pull a love oracle to see what the energy is between you two right now. All right, Spirit, Cancer, and their person, what's the main energy? You have deception. Oof. Someone is wearing a false mask in this relationship. Someone is not showing their true feelings and flirt. Extend your... <sighs> Let me see what this is. Someone is not expressing how they truly feel with you, Cancer. All right, so let's see. What is this relationship between you and your person right now as you're watching this video? The Wheel of Fortune. Destined, fated to be. This could also be a, a, a goal. A, um, this was destined to you to be with this person, okay? Um, I'm not, I don't know about forever, but it was definitely destined. This could also be a, a go around, okay? Another go around with this person. Um, what are your feelings towards this? The page swords in reverse. You're not saying much if you are. Um, I feel you could be spying on this person. Okay, how does your partner feel? The world in reverse, like they're tired of repeating this. <laughs> oh my gosh. <sighs> this person could be coming back from, 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 like if they went somewhere um, with Mercury retrograde coming in. And if they're telling you anything other than they're tired of repeating this with you, I'm telling you. Um, what's the obstacles and blocks with this nine of wands? The fact that you guys keep it's like every time you deal with this person, you feel like you come out of you came out of a battle. Like you just finished fighting a war. All right. Um, what's the best approach? Nine of wands. Remember who you are. Confidence is key here. Don't hold on to anything because of anything. You are this queen of wands. You are beautiful. You are attractive and you can get whoever you want. So remember that. All right. What's the potential future? The star. Healing. Healing. Nine of pentacles. And then you have the nine of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. I feel like you will be single from this person if you haven't already. But I feel like healing is the main, um, is the potential future from this. And I feel like you will separate yourself from this. Because again, you were fated to be with this person. But I feel like this was... It was faded because it was meant to show you how confident you are. It's, from, it's like to remind you how beautiful you are. How much of the shiznai you are. You know? And you and you found that out. Not a pentacles, the hermit in reverse, and the justice card. It's going to be with a Libra. But it's like it's been a long time coming. It's been a long time coming. And I feel like while this energy was in your space, it's like you couldn't see it with the hermit in reverse. This person is also not holding themselves accountable for the for what they did. But you don't have to worry about that because that's just showing you who, you know, who needs to be around you and who doesn't. I do see a new leap of faith here. It could be with an Aries. I would go towards that. Um, or an Earth sign towards Virgo Capricorn. But definitely this Libra or this Virgo got to go. All right, Cancer. All right, that's all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this. And stay positive.